let's talk about yours truly, Dave. Dave, you know the name. Dave is here. Dave is here. Yeah. Just remember, it's just Dave. It's just Dave, everybody. Just say it's just Dave. Uh, we're here doing a very special podcast here. For you guys, I got a treat for you. Not oh, any treat. Uh, you like surprises? I get surprises. If you don't like surprises, that's okay. I I got a book here that you might you might guys want to read. Six hundred page book in front of me here, folks. Best British mysteries. If you can believe that, seven uh, six hundred page book of mysteries from the British area. This is from the UK, folks. I'm from the so called UK. Uh, of the mysteries, and there's no photos, there's no photos, there's no, you know, glamour photos. It's just word, 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 wall to wall words, stuff of thing. So 600 page book, you're gonna like it, you're gonna enjoy it. 600 page book, how you like that? <laughs> so folks, if you like mysteries like I have like mysteries, you're gonna enjoy this book. I mean, this mysteries is pretty darn good. The best, it says right here in the book, this British mysteries, you can't get any better than that. If you like so-called mysteries or urban exploring, this will be the book for you guys. Uh, so yeah, on YouTube there's a lot of videos out there with urban exploring. They have name recognition all over it. Um, best British mystery, and I want to tell you guys, I'm telling this, I'm telling this like liberals would do. I'm telling this being the best British mystery. And the person who wrote this book, guess what? Guess who wrote this book? And all people. Guess what? I'll even tell you. I'll even tell you this subtitle. Hold on, hold on. This is not the third person here, folks. Uh, I'll tell you what the book says here. It says over 35 new short stories. Guess what? From the UK premier crime writers. That's right, folks. That's right. It's the best book. Seven dollars. Can you believe this seven dollar book? You're not breaking the bank, folks. Seven dollar book right here, my little ass. No, it's a, it's not a, a typo. This is real, folks. But uh, from the British area. So there you go, folks. The British mysteries are gonna love it. Six hundred page book. Did I tell? Did I say more? Uh, so from the UK, if you ever lived there, there's a lot of mysteries there. It said the best British mysteries, and the person that wrote the damn book is Maxman. What's his last name? Maxman Jackson, whatever his name is. But it's, it gives you quotes back in the book. It uh, gives you uh, people who actually read this thing. If you can believe it, back in this, uh, back in this book. Yes, yeah, so there you go, folks. Seven dollars book. Go at the store and buy this. A seven dollar flipping book. Uh, you're going to love it. It's a mystery book. It's a very much mystery book. Uh, if you know what I mean. If you like mysteries, like I like mysteries, this one books for you. Um, and I'm going to sell it as such. So there you go, folks. A British mystery book. 600 page book, if you can read that much. Uh, so there you go, folks. And there's no photos at soul ever. If you're going to ask me if there's ever any photos, there's no photos whatsoever. Uh, it's just um, text. It's just like, you know, literature. Uh, it's just like real literature with no uh, no photos whatsoever. So there you go, folks. I'm gonna I'm gonna tell I'm gonna tell this to you guys to go get this. I highly recommend it. If you want people to go get it? Yep, I highly recommend it. Seven dollar book. You can't go wrong. You're not gonna break the bank. That's my that's my opinion. My recommendation. Uh, my recommendation, just like YouTube videos would say. My recommendation video. Uh, it's gonna be my recommendation book. So there you go, folks. Take it. As I said, I'm going to promote this. I'm going to promote this heavily. That's, um, and I don't have a sponsor. I really don't have a sponsor, just so you know. I don't have a sponsor. Uh, so I'm just publicizing this as a person who really appreciates this book. Really appreciates this book. A mystery book. Go try it out. It's only $7. It says right in the book. Seven bucks. Go get it in stores. It's a, it's a best crime book ever mystery book from the British area, from the UK British area. And yeah, it's very good. So go get it. It's, um, it's fascinating. People read this book. And uh, yeah, a whole lot of experience, whole lot of crime written experience. Yeah, it's good. It's 600 page book. I kid you not right. I had my hot little hands here, folks. 600 page book of crime 
a crime book, a mystery book. So it's a crime book, essentially. Uh, so there you go, folks. Mystery beyond mystery in the UK. There's a lot of mysteries in the UK. I got tons of them. So uh, pros and cons, it says pros and cons, a story about pros and cons, once upon a time, and these are a contrast, contrast. So folks, we are ha having one of these good old days. Yeah, the good old days. Let's talk about the good old days, shall we? Yeah, sh uh, the good old days. Um, I'm just touting this as good old days. And this is a book, The Best British Mysteries That You Will Come to Appreciate. I'm not, I'm not uh, sponsoring this book. I want you guys to go out there and read the book. Uh, I'm not here to sponsor it from a, from a reader's standpoint or the person's name on this book. I'm just telling because I love this book. I really do love this book. A mystery book. If you like mysteries, like I like mysteries, you're going to love this book. 600-page book, shit you not. And there's no photos in here, just literature. Just uh, the beginning and literature. Uh, so there you go, folks. Give a shout out to everybody out there. You're truly Dave. Yes, Dave. You can call me Dave. Whatever. Uh, I'm Dave of all Daves in the world. There's Dave in the Bible. Dave and Goliath. Uh, I'm Dave. You're not. You're not Dave. I'm Dave. There's no two Daves alike. Uh, <laughs> you know. So there you go, folks. I'm telling a British book. Uh, just just like anybody out there would uh, tell their books. Uh, so there you go, folks. I'm for, I'm for Canadian, I'm for Canadian, not the American way. I'm for the Canadian uh, Canadian way. I got Justin Trudeau to thank for everybody. The Brit, the, <laughs> anyway, I want to appreciate everybody who comes to my podcast. This is Dave, I will, I will subtitle this, this video. And uh, this all had to do with mysteries, mysteries folks, mysteries. If you like mysteries, like TV shows, this is a book for you. Um, and this is for the sane people or unsane people. Uh, so if you like mystery, and I sure do, this is all about people with mysteries and stuff. Uh, it doesn't matter what the mystery is like. It could be good. It be, could be excellent. It could be a really hard. It could be a hair-raising book. It could be an exciting book. Exciting book. <laughs> and you know me, I like exciting books. Um, so there you go. I'm going to... Um, I'm not, I'm not a person who's promoting this. I just want you guys to read this. That's all. Just go out there to read this. Seven-hour book. You can't go wrong. If you don't like the book, you can throw it out. Uh, but, yeah, it's a book that you would put on your coffee table or just a, a just a, you know, uh, like a, a kitchen table. Uh, you know, just don't put it there, and someone will definitely pick it up and read it. Uh, so it's only a seven-hour book. If they want to see it, if they want to pick it up and read it, they can. At their leisure, as they say. Uh, so, yeah, it's a mystery book. And if you like mystery books, oh, do you know the mystery book? Well, this is a TV show called Unsolved Mysteries. This is called Unsolved Mysteries with Robert Shack. If you remember him back in the day. His name was Robert Shack, and he hosted a program called Unsolved Mysteries. And it was a TV show, and it told you about unsolved mysteries. These are mysteries that are unsolved. So be well aware of that. I'm going to leave you with that. Thank you, everybody, for joining me. This is my podcast. And, uh, yes, if you love Unsolved Mysteries, go to the TV show called Unsolved Mysteries. I, I would appreciate that you did do that. This is not a, this is not a shout out. This is uh, you guys to go check out. <laughs> check out. <laughs> really? Anyway, anyway, I'm going to tell my book here. This is not my book. This is somebody else's book. But it's all about mysteries. If you like mysteries, just like anybody, like Unsolved Mysteries, like Robert Stack. Remember his name is Robert Stack? Yeah. Remember that guy on Unsolved Mysteries TV show? Yeah, that guy? Well, yeah, he started up the show, but Unsolved Mysteries. And he talked about everything and everything. UFOs to Unsolved Mysteries to it, you name it. And, um, and sometimes they'll put up the 1-800 numbers, if you're lucky enough. Uh, so, yeah, if there's a crime to be made out there, he'll put up the 1-800 numbers. So, yeah, this what I'm saying. So, anyway, um, this is a, the UK's best crimes or mysteries ever. And there's crimes everywhere. Well, there's crimes everywhere. Uh, not that you people would expect, but anyway, I'm going to leave you at that. So, go check out this book. I'm going to take up your time, but I'm Dave, you're not. Uh, so, I just want to leave it at that. A lot of Daves in the world. There's David Goliath in the Bible. 
uh, what a coincidence, right? You're saying what a coincidence. Uh, uh, there's a lot of names that are uh, feeling with everybody else. So Dave, there's a lot of Dave's that no two Dave's are right, or whatever, how they would say it. <laughs> two days don't make it right, right? Anyway, I want to leave it at that, and yeah, yeah, yeah. Anyway, anyway, this book has no pictures whatsoever. If you're looking for a mystery book, no pictures, zero, zero. It's just literature. If you're uh, a person who want to le learn about mystery, this will be a book for you. Uh, it's a hair-raising book. It's probably a hair-raising book. Uh, that, by, by the way, that, that is great, great. Anyway, anyway, I'll see you guys later. Ciao for now. This is Dave signing off. See you all, you know, on the next podcast until I air another podcast. I'll show it to you on the subtitles. I'll put a subtitle here and I will give you the best of the bit of the doubt. And uh, yeah, just be excited who you are as a person, not a, not a, a creature. You know, it, we are going to going to be here as long as you want. But anyway, I'm going to leave you at that. Ciao for now, everybody. You know what to do. If you if you heard what I said, you're going to enjoy this book. I'm going to tell that put the title on here. And uh, you guys can read the book. I'll put the, uh, the title of the book on the subtitles in my uh, videos. Um, so until then, ciao for now, everybody.